Hello, my name's Mark Bishop. I'm the owner of a, this 2007 Vectrix motor scooter. Uh, I bought it in 2011 when it was four years old. Uh, it was originally uh, all, all electric, but it had a nickel metal hydride battery because that's what was available when they were designing it. And it was problematic. Uh, but in 2013, I put lithium uh, iron phosphate batteries in, and they've been a, they transformed the motorcycle. I mean, it, it more than doubled the range, and uh, we raised the top speed uh, from 62 to 68 miles per hour, and uh, it's been totally trouble-free for nine years, and it's no maintenance at all except tires and you have to wash it once in a while but not too often because it doesn't have a, have a oil film like gasoline motorcycles do so it's just been wonderful and it's got a lot of storage in it so i use it for grocery shopping you know anytime i can uh, weather permitting uh, and it's been just a pleasure to, to ride it around locally and uh, i I've ridden motorcycles my whole life, and I enjoy this thing as good as any motorcycle I've ever had. It's certainly the easiest to own. Electric scooters have traditionally been expensive. Uh, this one was $8,900. Uh, I bought it used for about $3,200, and it was uh, four years old. Uh, had bad batteries, uh, and I spent about $2,900 on batteries. Uh, so, but it's. You know, it seems like it'll run as long as I'm alive, you know. It hasn't deteriorated at all. It just, it's just, you know, it's a very durable thing. And of course you get, it uses 100 kilowatt hours per mile. I mean 100 watt hours per mile. And that's equivalent to about 300 miles per gallon. So it's extremely inexpensive to operate. So you get some of your uh, money back, you know, because it's basically free to drive. Uh, tires are more expensive than anything else because you know it's so cheap. Everything else is so cheap. There's no maintenance of any kind. Uh, but so I guess your initial uh, cost is up front when you buy them. Uh, and I don't see them getting much cheaper for a while because batteries are in such high demand. You know, it's, uh, car manufacturers are expanding their use of batteries and so on, but eventually there'll be batteries will be cheaper and then they'll be cheaper.